Hey everybody, it's me, Zach, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we have another DIY by Amy Slayton home renovation. Um, so I realized in filming this, this is actually like one hour and like 40 minutes worth of me remodeling this home. And if I did it to 4X, it was still like 30 to 40 minutes. And if I did it to 8X, it's 12 minutes. So, um... We're going to 12 minutes because I don't have time to talk for that long. Um, although I did split it up, I considered doing like the first part here for like 4X and then doing the second part in 8X because the second part was the part that was the longest because I took a break in between to watch RuPaul's Drag Race, which tonight I'm shook. Not only was All Stars 3 on, but they also introduced the new queens for uh, season 10, which... Low key, I already knew because I read spoilers for who the um, queens were. Mostly excited for my girl from Chicago, the Vixen. Excited about Blair St. Clair from Indianapolis because I lived in Indiana for two years of my life. And while I don't know her, I know a lot of drag queens that do know her. So I feel like I know of her by association. That's not me like trying to name drop. Just like I'm excited that um, some Indiana drag is getting recognize like I just think that's really exciting and it gives me hope for some other drag queens that I really loved from my two years in Indiana I hope they get recognized so anyways this is the new sorry for that tangent this is the new um home for Amy Slayton and the Black Widow Challenge I'm very excited about it we brought her minions Jody and Harper along we got good old Kurt here and we got Amy, obviously, and she's got all the money. Now, I opened this space up because I did not like how they had this small little kitchen space there. And um, I also didn't need many bedrooms because, low-key, we made a new place for our minions to hang out. You'll see that here in just a little bit. Um, actually, pretty quickly here. I was fairly excited about it. That's right, y'all. We added a basement. We added a basement for our minions to live in it's very exciting i struggled though because this is the first time i've ever made a basement and i was like struggling with how to get the like stairs to go somewhere that i wanted it ended up that they went into the backyard like this so i just made like a little privacy fence and the, uh, their own entrance obviously they're not going to be able to leave so we're going to make that we're going to lock that door and then in the basement, they each have their own little room that I'm going to assign to just them. So that's going to be exciting. I struggled with a gate. I was trying to put a gate on this. And then I ended up just giving a little door there on, from the inside. It was just easier. It is what it is. But yeah, I was really proud of this little area here. I think it's real cute. But yeah, that's just that just is what it is. Um, I also realized as I was filming, I started going with, like, a very, like, dark look for some reason. Like, everything is just very dark inspired. You know, I mean, I guess it's fitting because Amy is a black widow. She's murdering her husbands left and right. Uh, but I don't know. That's not really my style. So I don't know if, what that says about me, if that, like, reflects me. Also, once again, I'm having an adult premium beverage as I film this, so, you know, if you hear me slurping and drinking in the background, that's what it is. It ain't no big deal. It's not a big deal at all, y'all. Um, yeah, I'm so grateful. Well, I guess when this gets posted, it'll already be Friday, but I'm so grateful that tomorrow's Friday. I just had, like, a really long week at work, and I really need this weekend to recover, I'm planning on spending some time with Noel, my boyfriend. Um, I have a friend who I'm going to spend some time with Saturday during the day, maybe early evening. And then Saturday night, um, Bianca Del Rio is going to be in Chicago. And I'm going to see uh, her show, Blame It on Bianca, um, at the Vic. So I'm very excited about that. Uh, I'm going with my friend uh, from high school, who also lives in Chicago, even though most of, both of us grew up very far away. We're going to do that. I'm guessing he'll probably want to go out afterwards, so that should be interesting and or fun. Um, so we'll see what that looks like. And yeah, so just pumped for all of those things. 
Um, yeah, I tried to do some more experimenting in this. Um, I was more experimental towards the beginning <laughs> than I was at the end. You'll see as we get to the end, like, I just started putting things into, like, the bathrooms. I don't care what those look like. Like, do they function? Can my sons go to the bathroom? Can they pee? Can they shower? Can they clean themselves? You know. But I still did try to make it all look nice, and I think it looks 100% better than it looked before. Again, EA built homes are just, like, weird looking. I don't get them. Um, they don't make sense to me. I added this little half wall in there. I thought that might be cute, you know. Uh, but, yeah, so very much looking forward to this weekend. I also, like, realized my life would be much easier if I did some more pre-recording over the weekend. So I don't know when I'm going to find time to do that, though, because I, like... Tomorrow night, Friday night, the night that this is posted, I promised Noel we could do some stuff together, just me and him. I'm going to stay at his house Friday night, so I'm not really going to be in my apartment where I can film. I also keep, like, having these ideas that I'm going to start an ASMR video. So many people have commented on my videos that they just, like, listen to me talk um, and while, like, they're doing other things to fall asleep, and, like, I find that really flattering. I also like to listen to YouTubers talk to fall asleep, and so, um, I'm, like, actually really flattered that people utilize me to do that. Um, it's just, like, something I personally enjoy as well. Sometimes I do, I do have some, like, some YouTubers that I follow to do that, and listen to, um, among other YouTubers, like, weird niche of, niche is what I meant to say, y'all, niche, a weird niche of YouTube that I've really gotten into, and I've contemplated multiple times, like, making a video about this, like, why, I don't know, but there are, like, several people out there that, like, their channels are almost exclusively all Dollar Tree hauls, and, like, I would love to just do a video highlighting my favorite people because they get, like, the way they talk about the stuff, the cheap stuff they find at Dollar Tree. Like, they describe it with such detail and, like, it's, like, the most amazing treasure they've ever found and, y'all, it's literally, like, stuff that costs a dollar at the Dollar Tree. So, I, like, really could talk about that for hours and hours um, but I do want to start an ASMR channel, especially now that, like, I'm not monetized. Uh, and I've, like, been debating, like, how what impact that's had on channel views and stuff for me. Um, because honestly, like, I have... N I, my past few videos, my Amberlynn Reed video that I posted today uh, is getting around the same views I feel like it norm like that series normally gets. But all of my other ones, well, the Peter Mon is sticking around the same, which is about 30. And I feel like that's, like, the same 30 people that watch all my videos. Um, but, like, Trisha and Amy this week, like, are taking a really long time to, like, get their views up. And obviously it's not all about the views, but I am trying to grow my channel. Like, I do enjoy doing this. I want people to watch it. Like, I'm spending time on it. I hope people enjoy it. Um, but, yeah, I just, like, feel like, I don't know. I mean, people talk a lot about how, like, YouTube purposely, like, tries to get the monetized videos out there. Like, they're also making money off of that if you have ads on your videos. And so, they're obviously going to try to push that in their algorithm to show up more frequently. And I just am not convinced that mine are showing up as frequently as they did when they're monetized. But... Again, I made, like, nothing. And by nothing, I mean I really did make nothing. I finally started accruing money in my Google AdSense account, but you can't even get any of that until you make at least $100 on YouTube. So I'm not making anything on YouTube. Uh, I knew I used to have commenters that were like, you're using Amberlynn Reed for views. I'm like, one, am I? Probably, yes, correct. But, like, also, am I making money off of that? No, I'm not. Like, it's not that serious, y'all. It's YouTube. Um, but, yeah, I hope you really, like, are enjoying my YouTube series still. And I hope that you continue to watch it. I'm very appreciative of those of you that are and leave comments um, and interact with me. Uh, it's really good 
a really good time. I enjoy doing it a lot. Um, you know, like when I'm not like super loving my personal real life job, uh, YouTube is a good like escape for me to come and share some time with you. So, um, you'll also notice I love how like because this is going so fast, like you don't notice all the times I accidentally press the wrong button because you just like wouldn't know. You just see me putting things in and it looks like I'm doing everything very intentionally. So there's that. There is that. Um, but yeah, uh, I also like, again, didn't need a whole bunch of bedrooms. So the bedroom earlier that's like country chic is, is Amy's master bedroom. This is just like a little, uh, guest bedroom here. And I also put in a little desk, uh, cause I figure, you know, Amy might need to do some work, things like that. So that's a thing. But yeah, so there's that. Oh, you know what I realized now that I'm watching this back? I never put the graves anywhere. So whenever I play, like actually play, we'll have to do that. Um, I'll have to put up the, the graves somewhere, probably in the back by the pool. Um, we did have a pool. I'm not necessarily planning to kill Kurt that way. Although I honestly don't have a plan to kill him anyway. Like I haven't really thought about that, honestly. So we'll have to consider how we want to go about doing that. If you have any suggestions that you would like me to consider, you know, leave a comment post below. I remember to do some landscaping this time. I think it looks great, although the palm tree doesn't really go with all those like wildflowers and wild grass, but I liked it, so deal with that. But yeah, I think it turned out pretty cute. This is what it all looks like. Oh yeah, I put some stuff in the back. It's all good. But you know what? Um, I think I'm really going to end everything right here. Uh, so yeah, I can't wait to play in this house with Amy and her boo and her minions. Um, and have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful time. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you will click subscribe if you're new to my channel and hit the little notification bell so YouTube tells you when I upload. Uh, I also hope you'll leave a comment, hit like down below. I upload new videos Monday through Friday at 2 p.m. Eastern, so I'll see you all next time. Bye!